What's going on everybody, LK here, and today I want to talk about something that uh, got people pretty riled up in Guilty Gear already. This is the second open beta, and they made a bunch of important changes to the game, and one really big one, as if there wasn't already a bunch of controversial stuff in this game, is the new addition to landing recovery. It took a little bit for people to get over things like the really high damage and breaking the wall. So this issue with landing recovery is the new thing that everyone is mad about. So what are the changes first? So now there are certain ways when you move in the air and definitely when you do jump attacks, you can be punished on landing now because there's recovery. So not just jump ins where you see that the game told me I got a punish. So not a counter hit, I punished the landing recovery, but also even movement like double jump, or instant air dash back. So an easy way to remember it is that any extra air action you use will now have additional landing recovery. So why is this a big deal to people? Because people are worried that they won't be able to move as freely as they want to. And the last open beta, as well as the closed beta, a really big complaint about this game was how good the jump-ins were. A combination of characters having really good jump-ins and the way the new air dashes worked made it really tricky for people to pin people down in the air. That and all ground normals being air blockable, which is a new change for GG. Normally you have to spend meter in order to block normals in the air. So people thought being airborne was just too strong. And to be honest, I was one of those people. I thought that jumping was too strong. I was already used to them doing this in basically every modern fighter. And I, like many people, left that as feedback for the game multiple times. Jumping was really strong. You basically had to go air versus air. It was really hard to pin people down. It was really hard to stop people from holding up back out of everything. So they made two big changes to deal with this. One is that they buffed everybody 6p. 6p is your forward punch, it's generally an anti-air in Guilty Gear, and it works way, 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 way better than the previous patch. You're probably not getting a fat combo off it, but you can really discourage people from going directly at you with the 6p. But then also the other way is this punish, this landing recovery change. So really, Arxis did what we asked them to. Now, the main reason I like this change is it's actually in other Arxis games and it encourages people to make sure that they really do cover themselves and pick the right button for the right situation. Now, some people think this benefits characters that have bigger air normals because it's harder for them to whiff the air normal. And that maybe characters like Milia are nerfed by this, but I don't really think so. For the characters with bigger normals, they would be using those normals in that spot anyway. The whole point is that if you whiff poorly, that you can get punished. A character that has a big air normal that's applied correctly, that's fine. Whether or not there's additional landing recovery, it's not going to change that they're pressing that button. For characters with shorter ranges on their jump-ins, it just makes it so that you have to be careful of what you press. There's nothing wrong with protecting yourself with a move like this, but if you whiff and they get a punish on you, you have to realize that it's because you pressed it in a bad spot. I think the changes they made to anti-airs, the 6p forward punch, and this landing recovery change are both really good changes compared to the others. To be honest, this is a change I want to see in Dragon Ball. I know they're not going to do it because of the type of game it is, but I really like it when you can target people's movement like that. As usual, if you guys have any questions or comments, definitely feel free to leave them in the comment section below. Like and subscribe if you feel like it, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.